Dennis, and uh, I'm one half of Solstice from Chicago, Illinois. We are a future-based production duo, and we just played Electric Forest this summer. This is our second festival, and man, I really gotta say, I, I'm really, really liking this festival so far. It's very, very chill. It has a chill vibe, awesome people. For the first year, for it to be this big, it's amazing so far. And um, yeah, we're playing The Meadow today, and I'm just really excited. It's a treehouse stage, so it just looks crazy. That stage just looks amazing. It has like it's like a little green room, it's like a tree house, and then it has a, it's like where the stage is at, and it just has so much room for people, so hopefully it has a lot of potential. And um, yeah, we, uh, we've been at this for about three years. We started on FL Studio just producing Moonbaton actually, which is a genre I kind of died out, but uh, we got into future bass production after being influenced by artists like Porter Robinson and Odessa, who just happened to be headlining this festival which is why we're so excited and just thankful to be able to be part of this awesome place. Um, yeah, there are possibly our two biggest influences, so that's kind of like our sound is like kind of indie future, uh, just chill step is the best way to describe what we do. Um, and yeah, our SoundCloud is uh, We Are Solstice. All of our social media is just We Are Solstice. You can just like Google that and just find us right away. Um, are there any bands you're looking forward to hearing while you're here? Um, yeah, uh, well, we're here with a band called Karma Wars White Ties, who's also from Chicago, Illinois. I'm really, I mean, they're part of our crew, but I'm such big fans of their sound. They are indie rock, and they're from Chicago as well. We travel down here with them. Really young guys, really just fresh sound. It's really awesome. Just raw. They produce all their stuff on just the computer, which is really impressive record all the drum tracks and just do everything themselves and I think that's really impressive. I mean Porter Robinson and Odessa like I said are my biggest influences. I'm excited to see them. I also just love checking out random artists to be honest. There's a lot of Chicago talent here. Free Pizza, Smirk, um, well Loki, uh, you got Caveman. Just a lot of a lot of really really awesome talent which I think is cool that the festival got to do this and just bring a lot of you know up and coming talent to just showcase to Oklahoma. Um, yeah, it's the first time I'm down here in this area, so pretty, pretty cool festival. I'm really, really liking it so far, and um, yeah, it's uh, it's been, I mean, it's been awesome so far. It's just always awesome to just run into random artists that you don't know, and you're just like mind blown by this new sound. Um, some other bands, oh, Papadocio, of course. Everyone knows Papadocio. They're just fucking awesome. And um, I'm trying to think. There's just so much stuff here going on. <laughs> but yeah, no, those are the main ones that we're excited to see. I say Porter Robinson and Odessa, uh, and the Floozies, of course. Floozies always get down, and that's all tomorrow. They like bunched them all up, which is pretty awesome. We yeah. actually have, we're working on an EP right now, which should be coming out when my partner gets back. This is something I should mention, which is pretty, uh, kind of an interesting backstory that we have is that I'm half, like I said, of Solstice, my other half, <laughs> my other half, is deployed with the US Navy. He actually pilots the USS Houston. He's somewhere in the Pacific right now. We don't know where he is, but we're planning to release an EP when he gets back. We're just gonna, we're gonna produce. We're all about originals, man. Like, we love our original production. We do remixes, but originals is what we're best at, I think. We just like making all original sounds and just, you know, putting it all together. So yeah, we're planning to release an EP by the end of this year, I'd say. Doesn't really have a name yet, but, um, we have a lot of stuff out already. We have a pretty big remix, uh, Bittersweet Tragedy by Melanie Martinez. We remixed that track and it got like over a million plays throughout different platforms. We're almost at a million just on YouTube alone. So it's pretty cool. Well, thank you so much for your time. No problem, dude. Always awesome to talk to people. <laughs>